so I'm trying to get my U blocks GPS device to work and uh, so I, I, I just quickly solder four breadboard pins on this as you can see my soldering skills are pretty bad uh, but 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 ideally you want to be getting uh, this kind of pins these are called 1p 2p 3p 4p so they come in various configuration from 2 to 8 or 9 connections like these these are ideally suited for devices like these which carry just signals and no power um, so this comes really cheap around 20 hkd and you get like 500 of them this this connector so you want to get them um, so here is something from my u blocks so as you can see it runs from 3.3 .3 to 5 volts and the red wire is uh, this or uh, blue is the tx and green is the rx so one thing to note here is that uh, there is no reverse polarity protection in the device so you really don't want to reverse your vcc and ground here you need to be really careful so before i connect so uh, before i connect anything uh, these are my ftdi devices for serial ttl devices uh, this one is with it's called mini usb i think right and this one is the standard usb a uh, lot of these also have this connections here even mine i have this here so with this you can switch between 3.3 volts and 5 volts so currently i have set it to 3 volts but if you just plug and put it here it comes to 5 volts what this means is the ground and vcc are 5 volts in that case and if you set it on the left side it it comes to it's it's usually written there okay so before i connect my device i just want to be sure that uh, the voltage is actually correct so i got my multimeter here and i connect this to the pc it's connected to pc you can see it lights up and i just quickly want to see the voltage at uh so here the yellow wire is ground which is a second wire here and this is the vcc and you can see it's 3.3 uh, volts okay yeah okay so yeah um, so I just disconnect it now so I'm confirmed about the VCC voltage uh, so again so red is VCC so this goes like this okay okay red is the first one which connects to the green one here which is the 3.3 .3 volts so it's correct okay so next you want to connect the rx and tx pins okay so so in this case the green wire is rx which is the black wire here this so the black wire is the rx here and the white wire is actually the tx so let me just connect this uh, to this and yeah it's a little bit hard to see on the camera but i can see it clearly it says tx this this pin here is tx so my white wire goes wi white wire is tx which should go to rx this is rx okay and this is tx okay i hope it's correct uh, so i just connect it now uh, and i quickly go to my computer screen and i open uh, the cute com software that i use for serial device monitoring and i can see the device has come up stty0 so I just open the device okay so I can see some data coming here which means uh, I'm reasonably confident that uh, the device is communicating with me and I can also see the FTDI pin blinking that means data is being transmitted 
okay that's it for this video in the next video i'll go uh, outdoors and try to see uh, what data is in it